70 years ago next month, the United Nations was born in the ghastly aftermath of World War II. The idea was to build a forum where nations could replace conflict with cooperation to build a more peaceful and prosperous world. Now, part of that mission means fighting climate change through UN talks this December in Paris. In the run-up to the talks, the United States, China, and other nations have already put promises on the table to cut the dangerous carbon pollution that's driving global climate change. Those cuts will make a big difference. To protect our children from the ravages of climate change, though, we'll need to cut even further. At the Paris talks, we need to ensure future cuts in three important ways. First, let's clean up our dirty cars, trucks, and power plants at home and abroad. Next, let's step up the shift away from the fossil fuels that threaten our future and toward the clean energy economy of tomorrow. Finally, let's stop going to the ends of the earth to dig up fossil fuels that lock future generations into the cycle of destruction that's driven us to the brink of climate catastrophe. Climate change is a global problem. We won't solve it overnight. Over time, though, we must rise to this challenge for the sake of a more peaceful and prosperous world, for the sake of all of its children.